data storage refers to memory, components, devices, and media that retain digital computer data. However, when most people refer to storage, what they are talking about are disk drives or solid state drives and related technology, and that is what this tutorial series will focus on. There are two ways data is stored on drives. These are called block level storage and file level storage. Block level storage makes any type of storage device appear to the computer as a local drive. It doesn't matter whether the drives are internal, part of a direct attached array, or coming across a storage area network. The operating system of the computer will recognize block level storage as a raw drive that can be configured for use in many different ways. Large block devices are often configured or partitioned into smaller pieces called LUNs that are presented to the computer's operating system for different uses. There are several common technologies that provide block level storage. Internal drives or direct attached drive arrays are cabled directly, hence the name, to the computer's motherboard or PCIe host bus adapter. These types of block storage can only be accessed by the computer they are connected to. A storage area network, or SAN, is a computer network designed to deliver block level storage to computers that are not directly connected to the storage devices or drive arrays. In a SAN, a large storage device can be partitioned into multiple LUNs to be used by several different computers. The most common types of SANs include Fiber Channel, with its own special network running Fiber Channel protocol, along with special switches and host bus adapters that understand the protocol, as well as iSCSI and Fiber Channel over Ethernet, which use a standard Ethernet network to deliver storage LUNs to client computers. It is common to format a LUN and put a file system on it, but there are many applications, such as database applications, that can also read and write data direct to raw LUNs. This makes block level storage very flexible. File level storage is different. This is storage that is already formatted and set up with a file system to be used as a place to store computer files. File level storage is generally shared from one computer or network filer with several other computers. This type of storage can be created from block level storage, but it will never be seen as raw disk space by a client computer. Network file system and server message block are well known file level protocols. Common usage of this type of storage is as a shared file server where several computers and users can store documents in the same place for easy management and collaboration. From the user's perspective, File level storage will appear as just another directory or drive letter on their computer or virtual desktop to which they have access. Which type of storage to use depends on the intended application and the type of storage devices available. Stay tuned for the next DeMartech tutorial where we explore these ideas in more detail. In the meantime, subscribe to the DeMartech YouTube and check out our website at demartech.com.